We are currently in the Stanley Cup Finals, and we are against the Edmonton Oilers, and the series is 1-1 at the moment. So, basically, it's become a best of five now, and I think we could do it. You know, they got the better of us in the first game. We came back the second game, played quite well, took that one, and now we're headed to game number three. So, I don't know. We're going to be in Edmonton, but I think we could take one game here and maybe... Make it a best of three, or we could take both. That'd be sick. Just to sort of give you a refresher on our lines, and I will read it out to you in case the comments are covering it again. It really just depends on, you know, what I do in editing, but regardless, we have Vatanen, Elias Petterson, and Hosang on the first line. We got Meyer, Shifley, and Ricard Raquel on the second line. Kachuk, Strongest, and Radish, and then we've got Studnika. I don't even know if that's right, but that's what it looks like. Uh, Brown and Stringer. So, pretty good team. On defense, we've got Graves and Carlson, Bouchard and Pulak, Mata and Carlo. And then in nets, we've got none other than 71 overall, Tino Manny. Yeah, I've gone down one, actually, believe it or not. And we've got Fisher as the backup. A little stats update, never hurt anybody, but I don't know. It's going to show playoff stats, right? I know it showed... What? How do I view the playoff stats then? Oh, never mind. I didn't even know this was here, honestly, but regardless, we have 31 points in 19 games and then 28 in 19. The next closest is Shifley with 20. These two are carrying the whole team on their back right now. They are going to require some chiropractic sessions for their back after this. Are you kidding me? I don't know about goalies, though. We're probably not doing so well. Yeah, he had to come in as relief for one game. I'm not doing great. 885 and a 301. But, you know, it is what it is. And then the Oilers, they have Yamamoto with 23. Sam Steele with 22. Bertuzzi, Ehlers, Teravine, and Jones. All right, so yeah, they, they're doing quite well. But they're not even close to the level of Petterson and... The Vatanen imposter. Here we go. It is game number three in Edmonton. Series tied 1-1. Best of five pretty much now. And we are hopefully going to come out with a win. That'd be huge if we came out with a win in this game. So that way the pressure is kind of, you know, not as intense next game. We have a 1-0 lead heading into period number three. They have 20 shots. So I, I like this spot. This is good. Part of me kind of feels like my allergies are coming back. Because I had them, like, basically I didn't have them when I was younger. Then I randomly got them one summer, and I had it for, you know, two to three years. It was pretty bad, actually, and then it went away again. But now it sort of feels like it's coming back, but hopefully it isn't. I remember trying to record videos when it was bad it was a nightmare, because I'd be sneezing after pretty much every single cut, you know? It would, whenever it cut in the video, just probably I was sneezing. It would be my guess, or blowing the nose. I can't quite remember which one it was, but, you know... Well, I don't know why I would remember which one it was. Like, oh, after that one? Yeah, that one I was blowing my nose. After that one, yeah, I was probably sneezing. I couldn't even do, you know, like, long talk things. I would have to keep it brief. I couldn't do the ones where I'm kind of doing this right now, and if I start commentating what's actually happening in the game, wouldn't be able to do it. So, at least it's not that bad right now. So, I, I'm thankful for that. Here come the Edmonton Oilers. Yamamoto back to Clark. Back down low to Yamamoto, who's going to try walking out. But gets destroyed. Is he hurt? Is he Hoyt? I think he's Hoyt. He's going to get up. No, he seems all right. But it definitely didn't feel great. That is for sure. Big draw win. Nice pass and good shot. But a tremendous save by one Connor Hellebuck. Pass across the ice to Wenberg. Here come the Oilers again. He's trying to do something a little bit fancy with it. But our defense keeps it simple. Pokes it off of him. He wins the battle back in the corner though to get the puck. Clark walking in. Goes for a shot. Does not make it through. And Florida, that looked like a headshot to me, sir. I don't know about all that, but I think player safety might need to investigate. Ooh, Ehlers just going to miss the net. That was a little scary, though, for sure. Boom. Cross ice pass. Carlson gets it up. Oh, no. Don't skate backwards. Nice job. Nice job. Here we go, 2-7. Over to Shifley. Nope, that's not going to work. Yes, it is. It is going to work. Hosang back to Shifley and another great save. Come on, boys. We're putting up pressure, though. I love it. Okay, I don't like that. Don't like that. Please don't skate towards the net. You know, as it looked like you were on a breakaway there, except you were coming at your own net, you know? So next time, I would kindly suggest that you don't do that because it terrifies me. We are just about halfway through this third period. We still have the one to nothing lead. I don't believe I've received a single shot yet. 
actually on net. Which I'm not really going to complain. You know, if they get no shots, I could care less. Sorry, I totally messed up that saying. I know that people used to mess it up all the time. And I just did it. I couldn't care less. There we go. That's what it's supposed to be. Hints gets it to Heinen. Oh boy. Nice. Good job, team. Big fan of this pressure we're putting up right now. This is great stuff. I mean, at this rate, we're bound to score. You know? Like, it's one of those things where we're going to score. It's just a matter of when. I don't know. But it's going to happen. Bertuzzi coming in. Gonna miss the net now. Still don't think I've faced a single shot on net. Maybe one, but I, I can't really remember it. Now down to six minutes in this third period. And we are playing so well, we just can't score. Hellebuck is playing outstanding. I, I would say I'm playing good as well, but I, I don't know yet. I haven't been tested. So I really have no clue if I'm actually playing well or... If I just haven't received a single shot. And I'm probably going to go with B on this multiple choice. Bertuzzi, no! <gasps> no way you're kidding me. You are absolutely kidding me. I thought he was going to take the shot, but then he just dished it off. And I did not, re I could not react on time, honestly. I wasn't ready for it. 11th goal this playoffs. Kyler Yamamoto, look at this. Our defense stands him up, but he gets passed anyway. Great pass. I tried to get over. It was just too little too late. That's going to tie this game up with probably about five minutes left. Not what we're looking for. No, nope, definitely not. But that was certainly a good play by the Oilers. I got to give it to them. I hope there isn't a momentum shift now. If we can just keep up the way we were playing, then I really do think that we're going to get one. It's just a matter of time. Oh, not like this. Not like this. Wenberg, okay, I'll take that save. That was an easy peasy save. And I still only have one goal on me. I mean, I have two shots now. So I think my save percentage is a 500. Not good. But, you know, it is what it is. Overall, we probably have 22 shots now. So I'm sitting pretty there. Are you kidding me? This man. What a goal. That looks, like, realistic, honestly. Passes it in front. I need to double check. I might have just been, you know, hallucinating and making stuff up here. But look, he faked the shot and then did, like, the whole forehand, backhand thing. Let me see this again. Imposter passes it in. Yo, this guy. He didn't really fake the shot, I don't think. He just kind of... You know, went like, oh, and then, no, sir, I'm actually going backhand. And tucked it home. What a goal. He definitely is the better 3-4. Now just two minutes to go, and we have our lead again. It's only one goal, so it's not comfortable whatsoever. Very scary, in fact. If they get one shot, they could tie it up, and it could be added to overtime. So, oh, nice try, boys. Need a big draw win from you, PD, and we get one. Nice. Point to point. Going to get it to the Vatnin Imposter, who's able to somehow just muscle his way through. Gets a nice shot off, but Hellebuck's going to save that. We got 50 seconds to go. Bertuzzi. Over to Sam Steele. Goes for another pass. That won't get through, though. Steele ends up with it. That's going to be a great shot. I really don't like those situations, because, man, you never know when the puck is going to find its way through. So, luckily, we were able to make a stop. 35 seconds. Empty net. That's not going to go in. And Clark picks it up. Starts coming back the other way now. Steele. In the middle to Bertuzzi. Bertuzzi walking into... Oh, there we go. Big save. That was huge. Sam Steele has it again. Oh, man, dude. They are just sharks circling their prey right now. This is terrifying. Come on. Oh, it's offside. All right, 15 seconds. Nice. This could be it. 10 seconds. You know what? I'm not... This can't be it. This isn't it. Because I'm not willing to get sniped on from, you know, the red line again. Like what happened in the Toronto series. No, sir. Okay, this is definitely it now. We have officially won game number three. So it is 1-0 for us in the best of five that now exists because of the 1-1 tie after the first two games. Let's see how many shots. They ended up with 24. Nice. So that means I made three saves and let in one goal in the third. Love that for me. Selly it up, boys. We deserve it. That was a big win. And we are one step closer to the Stanley Cup. I can't believe I'm saying that again. If have we won two? No, I'm pretty sure we only won the one with Ottawa, right? So this would only be our second cup. Well, anyway, let's jump right into game number four, also in Edmonton. And game number two of the best of five. Boom, first period, 1-1. One, one. Second period, oh, 1-1. One, one. We have a tie situation heading into the third period here. Who will come out on top? It'll be huge if we win, but also huge if the Oilers win. Here we go, Panthers. Let's see what you're made of. Well, I already know. Oh, Wow, apparently they're made of something a little bit stronger because PD just got dropped like a two-foot putt. I was not ready for that to start this one, but hopefully that doesn't 
have any sort of momentum shift. Need a big draw win here. Come on, Petey. He does it again. He does it again. Carlson gets it to Ho Sang, but he's going to get tied up. Nothing really going to come from that. The Oilers now headed this way. In the middle to Yamamoto. Oh! Wow, that was scary. I was not prepared for that. In the... Oh! In the middle to Bertuzzi. He's going to take a shot, but that will go wide. Clark now has it at the point to Bertuzzi. What's he going to do in the... Oh! Oh, no. Oh, no. That was so bad on my part. After that first little bit, I started to flop like a fish because I was panicking again. Clearly, still haven't learned not to do that. Even though I've tried to tell myself every single time. Because I do the same thing every single time. But truthfully, to win the cup, you do need a little bit of luck. You know, it's usually some situations in there that you need to have balances go your way. Definitely. And that was one of them. So, I'll take it. Teravainen now has it. Nice! He didn't even get the shot off. Carlson with a tremendous defensive play there to prevent that from happening. Don't let them walk out. Thank you. And good job, Florida. Nice goal. What a shot. This guy walks out. Sort of pulls it back, just chills for a second, and then boom, picks his corner. Timo, the sniper. Let's see this again here. Walks out, puts it off to the side, and he didn't even choose top corner. He just went bottom bins there. Look at that. And he elbows him in the head, just for good measure. And then they elbow Jones in the head. We're just tossing bows everywhere. Boom, snipe show. Hellebuck, couldn't save that one. Little elbow to the dome just to rub it in. I'm surprised there wasn't a line brawl, to be honest with you. Ehlers, wow, okay, there's no chance I was saving that, absolutely no shot, that pass was like instantaneous, like I, I don't even know if it was possible to react to that on time, could have possibly done a flying poke check, but there's also really no way I could have suspected this was going to happen, just, but yeah, no, alright, I, I will admit when I have been beaten fair and square and that was just an incredible play, Passing down and immediately... Yeah, I didn't have time to react. Okay, good goal. Well, that didn't take very long, but we are tied once more. Shifley goes for a shot. That's not going to make it through. Nice pass up to Wenberg. Here come the Oilers again. Ehlers now over the blue line. Makes a little head fake move, but loses the puck. Florida now has it behind the net. Oh, he loses it. Win that battle. Win that battle. You have to. You have to. Come on now, Timo. Carlson ends up having it taken from him. Goes for a shot there. That's not going to go in. Another shot in the slot. That will be saved by Tino. Ehlers now has it. Man, these guys are on fire right now. There's like, these passing plays are just unstoppable. All right, Florida. Well, now we're down by one. So we need to get a goal here quick. Otherwise, we are not in a great situation. And we also just got a power play. So that's great news. Let's take advantage of this. Well, my saves category is going to be brutal, so let's hope I can at least get team play up. And nope, because John Carlson is going to rob me of that opportunity. Thanks, sir. Greatly appreciated. I'll definitely get this one, though. Just pass that to you. That's a nice, simple play right there. They're not even dumping the puck in. Like, what is this? Ooh, that looked like it hit the mask. But that was another cross-crease attempt somehow, even though they are short-handed. So I don't know why we're letting this happen. What a play! What a play by the Florida Panthers! Great pass over to Petey. He's gonna kind of fake the shot. And I think, yeah, it was Brady Kachuk that he sauced it over to. He's gonna tuck it home. Let's see a re- What the heck just happened? Hello? Did you guys see that? It's like everyone's head just kind of snapped back. That was weird. Anyway, let's get a replay here. Stanley Cup Final, that's right! Petey! Actually, was that Petey? I feel like Petey's number 41. Who's number 40 then? I can't even- Oh, it's the captain. It's got to be Stronges. Stronges fakes the shot and passes it over. Boom. Lots of cross-crease goals so far in this third. Steele has it over to Jones, who walks in, goes to take a shot, but that's not going to go through. And now Florida's headed back the other way. Let's go, Panthers. Timo walks in over the line. Jones going to take it from him. And an undisciplined play there from Timo. Gets a slashing call. Oh, boy. We are shorthanded. With seven minutes ago, tie hockey game. A draw win would be very nice here. Oh, that's unfortunate. Danton Heinen gets it over. That's not going to go, but it's also not going to be threatening, thankfully. We managed to get it out. Costin picks it up. Pedersen really battling for that. He comes out on top. Holy crap. Let's go, Pedersen. Showing why he is dominating the leaderboard right now because he was able to win a battle shorthanded two on one. Guy just makes it look easy. Wenberg in the middle. I knew it. I knew there was going to be a pass. Of course there was. 
Gonna be another cross crease coming up in probably five seconds. Win that draw. We need it. Oh boy, I don't know. He did! He actually managed to take it home. Fire me up. That's gonna get the puck out. 30 seconds to go left on their power play. So we are doing a great job of killing this thing so far. And with another clear down the ice, that will do it. We have officially killed the penalty. Great job, team. Oh, do it to them. Get the lead. Get the lead! Nice try. Man, if we got that, that would have been such a kick in the tuchus. They had a power play. They had it all set up. And then we just kill it and immediately go score. Holy. Two and a half to go here. Third period. Game number four. Panthers currently up two to one. Oh, he breaks his twig. Unbelievable. But yeah, we have a very, very close matchup here. Ehlers goes for a little deke. That's a quick save. Don't mind if I do. He's going to get it again, though. In the middle to Wenberg. That's another quick stop. Oh, boy. They are putting up all of the pressure right now. Another save. I'm smothering that. I was going to pass it, but no. I need to get some momentum for the Edmonton Oilers killed here. There we go. Need a big draw win, though. Big draw win here for the Panthers. He's going to do it. I love that for us. I feel like we haven't seen many overtimes in this playoff run so far, but we might be seeing one right here. 30 seconds to go! My guy. What was that? So I wanted to confirm a suspicion here, and yeah, this, this doesn't touch Hellebuck. This man just straight up turns into Elon Musk. Shifley is now Elon Musk, just sending random objects to space. On today's episode, a freaking puck. Overtime it is, folks. We are going to a golden goal here for game number four. This is going to be a suspenseful one, for sure. The Oilers with the draw win. Clark has it. Skates around to Jones in the middle to Steele, and oh, we stole it from Steele. Let's go, Vatan Imposter. Nice try. He attempted to get it to the better 3-4, but unfortunately, wasn't able to get through. Yamamoto now coming with the puck. Gets it over our blue line. In the middle to Bertuzzi. That'll be stopped. Oh boy, another save on Yamamoto there. This is just unbelievable right now. The amount of saves that Tino Manny is stacking up. Nice. Come on, 3-4. Oh, he had the right idea. That would have been a disgusting goal if he got that to the forehand. Yamamoto rips one. Relax, dude. Jeez, that was like a howitzer and a half. Bertuzzi with it. Walking in. He puts it back to Clark at the point. Over to Jones. Bertuzzi with it again. A great save. Oh, my word. Tino Manny playing outstanding right now. We need a goal here. Come on, Panthers. Come on, Hosang. Nice try, guys. Nice try. Teravainen gets it in. I was about to go for that, but quickly realized that that would be a rookie mistake. So I found my way back home. Boom. Nice pass up to Shifley. Great passing here from the Panthers. Oh, he's going to get rocked. He's going to get rocked. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. We're one game away. We are one win away from the Stanley Cup. Are you kidding me? right now boom Let, i want to see a replay of the goal show me a replay i mean yeah we're happy selling everything but i want to see the game winner that was nasty show me stanley cup final boom he runs into the boards love that great pass what a shot hellebuck did not stand a chance on that one boom headbutts the glass for good measure and tucks it home what a play from the panthers one win is all we need. Oh, they actually ended up with 31 shots and three goals. So yeah, that's not bad. That's a that's a 900 right there. I'll definitely take that. Fire me vertical. And let's see if James has anything to say. Just kidding. He will not. But well, maybe. But I don't even know. I, I don't have the headphones in for that. So if he does start talking, I'm not going to hear a word that that man says. But the way this has been going, I feel like we're in the clear anyway. It's the playoffs. Boom. Walk down that hall. Heads held high. We are heading back to Florida with the chance to take home the cup at home. That is incredible. Oh, we have a conversation with Mr. McKay, our agent. What's up, sir? Boom. Uh, oh, well, sure. Why not? Let's renew it because at this point, I think, you know, Tino has a couple dollars in his pocket. Well, guys, we are one win away. One win. That's all it takes. That's all that separates the Florida Panthers. The Flo Rida Panthers from the Stanley Cup. Will we be able to take it home in the next video? Or will Edmonton push a Game 7? I guess we're going to find out. But right now, we are definitely in the driver's seat. We are up 2-0 in the best of 5. 
And I really, really, really like our situation right now, guys. So be sure to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe. And I cannot wait. I'm, I'm going to go record it right now. I am so excited.